I'm standing over by my Swiss chard. And you may know from other videos that we got some starts last fall, got them in the beds, and then they've been overwintering, and then now they're growing again. Um, we got six Swiss chards. And I decided to plant them in a little bit of an experimental way. I did four in one square foot, which is what traditional square foot gardening is gonna tell you you want to do. And then I planted two of them um, and gave each of them their own square foot. And I think it's been really kind of interesting to watch. I've been very mindful about harvesting from all the plants. So if I harvest with shard, I go and harvest from all of them so that that's not necessarily a factor. But let me just show you what my plants are doing. So this is one of the Swiss shards, the one with the colorful stalks. This kale right here is kind of in the way, so let me move that. This is one that has the full square foot. And you can see the size of the leaves. I mean, for, for scale, there's my hand, there's the leaf. And here's the second Swiss shard. They are big, long, and you get a lot of, you know, stalk and leaf when you harvest, and I really like that. So those are those two. And on this side, it's the four. Let's see if you can see that there's four distinct plants here. One, two, three, four. And just to kind of be fair, there's the leaf and there's my hand. So what I have found is the ones that have more space have definitely grown significantly bigger and it just makes me wonder you know if the whole point of square foot gardening is to grow more food in less space okay I get that but I'm not necessarily growing as much Swiss chard in the four plants in the one square foot than I am the two plants in the two square feet in fact I think it might be interesting to just look at what would one plant in one square foot, how does it measure up to the four plants in the one square foot and really look at production levels that way. So I think what I wanna do is make a harvest from all four plants and then make a harvest from one of the ones that's growing by itself. And then I can compare, maybe I can weigh the Swiss chard and see did did the four plants in the one square foot actually produce more food than the one plant is that has its own square foot? All right, so I said yesterday that maybe we should do like a little experiment. So I brought the scale out here. I've got a plate, I got scissors. I'm not exactly sure how this is gonna work, but I'm going to go harvest what I can and then let's measure it and then compare. Here's the plate from the two. And what I just realized is that I really shouldn't have cut from both plants if I'm trying to compare one square foot to one square foot. So bear with me, people. I guess we'll have to do a little bit more math than I wanted to. And I think we should measure this. I don't think it's gonna be that heavy. Set it to grams. So let's just see. This is the harvest from two Ow. And this was everything that I could reasonably cut off. Oh, there's a little bug on there, all right. So it's 116 grams, let me show you. But now when I move it, okay, just trust me. There you go, 116. Okay, so 116 divided by two is 58. So I think that's kind of the number that we want to beat. So this is plate number two from the four. So let's turn our scale on. It's in grams, and let's do it. 
So what did we say? 116 was the other one, and half of that is, oh my gosh, it's too early to do math. Half of that, what's 116 divided by two? <laughs> 58, is that what it is? I think, hopefully I'm not showing my horrible math skills on YouTube. Oh, I think we're gonna beat it by a lot, actually. So I'm already at 55, 57. Okay, this is 58, actually 59, no 58. So that's that, and that's still what I have left over. Let me keep going. Oh. Let's see if I can just do this. Oh, let's not get the pine needles. Okay, so this is kind of interesting. The four plants in one square foot, the total harvest was 114 grams. The two plants in two square feet was 116. So definitely, they basically provided the same amount, but this one only took up one square foot and that one took up two square foot. So I am so glad that I took the time to kind of run through this because when I look at the plants, the ones in their own square feet look so much bigger and it feels like I am getting more food out of them. Um, but the reality is, this four plants in one square foot, that harvest is right now saying 115, and those two plants taking up two square feet of my garden were at that same amount. So really, I think these are growing more food for the amount of space. So I love having that confirmed. Um, and I would like to know what you think about this. Was this helpful for you? Did you find this interesting? Is this the kind of stuff you might like to see us do more of?